Good afternoon. Albuquerque police say they are having trouble keeping up with all the murders in this city. We are now up to 75, the most since 1996. News 13's Allison Martinez is downtown live at APD headquarters. Allison. Brittany, not only is the homicide rate up, but APD's rate of solving these crimes has gone down. The official number of homicides for the year comes to 75. APD says their clearance rate saw a significant drop. The clearance rate is usually in the high 80s, and this year they barely hit 60%. The lack of witnesses. We always run into this. We don't have anybody coming forward in these last 15 deaths of homeless people at all. We, I mean, they're just dead ends, and it's very frustrating for detectives to try and generate and find these leads when they're not available immediately. APD only has five homicide detectives to handle this caseload, but they say staffing is just one factor, making it difficult to solve every case quickly. The environmental factors can be they're outside, there's not much of a scene. Or that's a secondary scene. Maybe that body was moved from the primary location to a secondary location. So the detectives don't have much to go off of. APD says they're looking at outside resources to help them solve these cases. They're working with a group of civilians to see if the homeless population would be more willing to talk to them about what they're seeing on the streets. Brittany, back to you. Okay, Allison. APD also says they are looking at shuffling detectives from other units to homicide to help with the caseload.